Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And it is time for another anime review. And this is Lupin the Third, Figma doll of Fujiko from the anime Lupin the Third. But before we look at her herself, we're gonna look at the box. It's got some Japanese writing because this box comes straight from Japan. And I know what line it came from because it's Lupin the Third. These are the other figures they make Inspector Zenigata and Lupin the Third himself. We get some nice product shots, some more Japanese writing. You know the gist of this box, <laughs> probably right now. But now we're going to look at Fujiko herself. And this is a really well sculpted figure. She gets some good posability. You get bend at the knee. She's got a gun in her hands and go pew, pew, bang, bang. Ain't that cool? I love that. That they give her some articulation. She can bend her knees, move her ankles. It's a good looking figure, if I do say so myself. This is going to be a quick review, so now we get down to comparisons. With some other gun-toting anime girls. First on the list, we got Major from Ghost in a Shell. I think I dropped her handgun on the shelf. Give me a second to retrieve her gun. The gun I gave her. She does have a problem holding her gun on the shelf. I have to have her Grabs it with both hands, but here we got my other gun-toting girl herself. Major, the android girl from Ghost in a Shell. And finally, with Nasumi, a.k.a. Armitage, from the movie Armitage, and they're both police officers, so yeah. But Fujiko is a human being with a gun that she can shoot Zenigata in the foot if I had him, and you know, pew. Pew, bang, bang. And this is not a bad-looking Figma. You're probably wondering, where did I get this? Well, I got this from eBay for about 30 bucks. Is she worth that kind of money for a Japan exclusive? I'd say yes. Pick her up. She is worth adding to your Figma doll collection and Figmas. She's not a bad-looking figure. And she's downright cool-looking. And these clothes are real fabric, so yeah, they feel like real denim, real black fabric. So this is a good-looking figure. Probably wondering, does her head move? She, Her head does not move. But if it did, it would have been extra cool. But given this is a small Figma doll, it's not bad for 30 bucks. And that's all there is to say for this review. If you like this video, please make sure to like. Please make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. This is Eddie Hill, moving on, and rock on, and rock out, YouTube land.